Oh, Craig's so excited about seeing Caitlin. Keep waiting for his head to explode. Please don't talk about exploding heads. Okay, it's like that with her girlfriend, especially with her being in the army. Hey, it's great to have her on. Oh. Try not to sound too enthusiastic. Uh, you have to excuse our Kate. I'm treating me and keeping keen, that's her motto. All right, built up. What he means to say is that I'm not a particularly gushy person. <sighs> she makes the Terminator look like Holly Willoughby. <laughs> that sound just like our Sophie. Nothing wrong with a little bit of old-fashioned mm -hmm. reserve. In my day, we never had time to share feelings. That's because you were too busy fighting off pesky Vikings, eh? Seth reckons I should wear my heart on my cheek more. Right. As opposed to wearing it on your sleeve like me. Suppose. Thing is, A, I still don't really get what it means, and two, it's a really disturbing image. Hiya. Hey! <laughs> I thought you were sleeping in. Sleeves for wimps. Anyway, I want to spend every available second with you. That's so sweet. <laughs> Also, I bought some scarf. I thought we could have lunch together. If that's okay. As if you have to ask. How did your dad get so lovely? Since when do you like couscous? Picked up a taste for it. Mm. Well, look at you two, eh? Mm. I love a good spread, me. Hey, Sam, look. Stuffed peppers. Oh, I hate you. Um, <laughs> feel free to join us. Oh, don't be daft. I know better than to come between two lesbians in a mezze. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> Sorry about that. Off the aim. What? Do you know what's funny? When we first met, you thought burger and chips was a food group. Well, can't a girl expand her horizons? Hey, I'm not complaining. So you like the new me? Yeah. I also like the old you. Think of it as an upgrade. <laughs> Kaz, you're a total knockout. Why can't you see that? It's just enough that you see it. No, it's not. And neither should it be for you. Look, you want an equal relationship, right? Well, it goes without saying. Right then. As of today, we're both equally gorgeous. <laughs> Is that clear, soldier? As Crystal, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> she's alive, Wyatt. Yeah, she's the best. Mm. Oh, Must be great having her own. Yeah. Yeah, it is. You don't seem too certain about that. <laughs> oh, some stupid. Darling, I'm married to Steve. Stupid's way of life. <laughs> okay, don't get me wrong. I love her to bits and I'm, I'm over the moon that she's here, but... but it's also really intense. And you feel like you can't catch your breath? Yeah, something like that. Since we met, we spent the sum total of three weeks together. Three weeks and seven months. Well, you know, it's, it's quality, isn't it? Not, not quantity. Yeah, you know what? You're right. I forget I even mentioned it. You know what? Me and you, we should go away. Away? Yeah, away. As in, on holiday. Pickers do that, don't they? Well, that's been known to happen. Where'd you have in mind? Dunno. The world's our lobster. Oh, oh. oh some winter sun, it would be nice. Oh, very nice. We look like a pair of blood donors that can't say no. I tell you what, what about next week? Let's bin work off and hop on a plane. Oh, it's a lovely idea, but no can do. Mm. I've got two weddings, four christenings. What about early December? Come first of the month, I'll be knee-deep in Christmas prep. There's the uh, nativity scene to design, and then the carol services to organise, and then the choir to finally tune, and then, let's not forget, the bishop's legendary advent party. All right, then. What about Christmas itself? You're funny. I'm serious. Are you asking me to give up Christmas? Christmas is like my Glastonbury. I was born to read Midnight Mass. You really are a nerd, aren't you? <laughs> All right, then, what about January? January's tricky. Let me guess. You're headlining Vegas. No, funerals. Funerals? It would, nobody gets buried over Christmas, do they? So it's often a backlog. Oh, that's cheery. Mm. All right, then, Feb. Lent and more funerals because of flu season and all that. <sighs> March? Beginning of Easter. And Easter's important, Carl. I'm gonna pretend you never said that. So what you're saying is basically between now and the next six months, it's a no-go. Mm, basically. Oh, it was a lovely idea, though. Let's get some shots. Go on, then. Oh, you none of that. So last night we came, not letting you get her splattered. <laughs> you get her splattered, the girl's got hollow legs. I can't do what I want to do so with no chance. Mm, what are you gonna do? You can tell us, love. Yeah, you're practically family. Do you mean that? 100 percent You make Kay happy. That's all that matters. What a set of date for the wedding. Well, go for it then. You don't think I'm jumping the gun? No. 
Aiden, don't interfere. You know what your sister's like. No, I'm not interfering. Don't listen to him. Maybe I should just leave it. And what happened to her? Who dares wins? What's the SAS? Ah, it's the same thing. Come on. <clears throat> <clears throat> She's got someone to ask you. Oh. Over to you. Um, <laughs> Kaz? Another time, love. April, what about it? We should get married. We've just got engaged. Well, all the more reason to strike while the iron's hot. I love the attitude, but it's just a bit sudden, like. Sudden? You're kidding, right? I have wanted to marry you since our second date. Babe, this is me taking it slow. It's romantic, isn't it? Yeah, me, I'm well enough. Where are we going to get the money to pay for it? We'll make it work. OK. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Oh, yes, I'm dead, Joe. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>